there is this lock. It's lock 11 and 12. And we had never seen anything like this. It was a double lock. Hey there, I'm Sam. And I'm Brev, and we are continuing to cruise on America's Great Loop aboard the Here's To Us. Yeah, today's journey actually took us from Frankfurt <laughs> to Campbellford, and it was kind of a physical day because uh, a few locks and a lot of waiting and, uh, and a boat with us the entire way. Yeah, we left Frankfurt kind of early because we wanted to get to the lock and wait for it to open. Um, but the first six locks, if you remember, we went through by ourselves. Yeah. But this day we did not get so lucky and we had another boat that was in front of us already there at the lock waiting yeah, they when were at we the... got to lock seven. Yeah, they were at the blue line already waiting. Yeah. And the lock also delayed its opening. We timed our arrival to just hit it there right at nine o'clock at opening time. Yeah. But uh, the lock staff had something to do with the lock doors to grease them or whatever. So a little bit of maintenance thing. Uh, and then we finally got in the lock about mm -hmm. 12 minutes after 9, so not too bad. Yeah. Way, but, yeah. Right. So um, the difference in a couple of these locks, it, the all of the locks were manual on the other one, and then we're starting to see some automatic uh, gates, um, that kind of technology. Yeah. But what, what we did notice about this was uh, very narrow channels. Uh, right. There's not much margin for error, hence uh, 10 kilometer speed limit, which equates to about six miles an hour, is about fast enough. And uh, while we did see some other boats uh, exceeding that, some smaller boats, some fishing boats uh, putting out some wakes, uh, we are real cautious of putting out any wakes, particularly going through the narrow channels where there are some homes with docks. Yeah, it just seemed like the day was very long Yeah. because not only did we go through six more locks, but we also had to go slow. Yeah, but it was worth getting to Campbellford. It oh, was, yeah, uh, definitely. Uh, it's, a, it's a great place. But right before Campbellford, there is this lock. It's lock 11 and 12, and we had never seen anything like this. It was a double lock. Yeah, and so you go in, and uh, it takes you up 12 feet. Oh, I then, thought you said 24 feet. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, 24 yeah, feet. The first 20, yeah, lock. 20, right? Yeah. 24 feet, and then you get up there, and then another door opens, and you go uh, move forward, and it takes you up another 24 feet for a total yeah. lift of 48 feet. So uh, yeah. quite impressive. Yeah, it was, uh, it was intimidating when we turned that turn the corner and saw this monster and then you see the lock gates halfway up and um, I don't know it was uh, you handled it all calm cool and collected but uh, anyway <laughs> yeah. it was it was scary yeah so uh, after that the chant the from lock 12 over to where we have parked at Campbellford it was such a beautiful beautiful cruise because there are a lot of parks um, area picnic tables with families and on both sides and just lovely um, area and you, and you can really see the people here just really cherish the, the summer uh, time because <laughs> you know it's it's a very short season for them so they're out and uh, having a great time yeah so um, they did here have a stay two night get one night free and we totally are into the freebie so we, yeah. we've stayed here we are staying here for three nights yeah so uh want to tell them what we did here yeah. yeah um one night they had a concert in the park right across from us we decided to have dock tails over here and um we so we invited all there yeah, we started four... out with there was three boats total in okay. us, mm -hmm. and then a fourth boat came in, right. and we invited them, and then a fifth boat came in, and so we're yeah, like, so that was a big party can we for get us. Ten total people uh, on the bridge. Of yeah, our boat? so we have crammed, we crammed we everybody in, and, yeah. uh, and we had, had a great, great time. oh, really nice time. Yeah, the the people, people we met, fantastic. Yeah. Also, some things in the area that we have seen. There is this giant money. A toonie, they call it's it. Toonie, yeah. It's huge. A, a big statue right across uh, the river here. Um, we also found a bakery, mm -hmm. award-winning, yeah. award-winning bakery, mm -hmm. and we got right. 
We got some bagels, right. and we also um, act, happened to get that donut that they say people stand in line, the lines waiting out the yeah, door. Yeah, they call it for... a cream-filled donut, but it's actually, <laughs> when we did see it, it was a donut sliced in, you know, like half horizontally, yeah. and then cream. It looked yeah, like, like a, a you know, sandwich. what do you call that, ready whip, you know, stuff, and then I think it was sprinkled. Um, but anyway... Um, not really my thing, but yeah, uh, we real, decided to try it anyway. Real cream. And then uh, Empire Cheese. We went to the oh, grocery yes. store and got uh, right? Empire Cheese. Yes, and it was lovely. We served it at the Docktails. It was caramelized onion cheese, which mm -hmm. was really good. And then Rev went to the world's finest. Yes, I did. There's a, a world's finest uh, chocolate the factory as well as the outlet here. So that we heard about, yeah, you got to go see it. There's great deals. I walked in there, I'm like, why does this look familiar? And it's because I was in education and all the kids I taught and all the kids I knew were selling world's finest. It's all the fundraiser, chocolate fundraisers in Texas um, seem to use world's finest. So that was kind of a flash uh, <laughs> back to the past. Um, anyway, of course I bought some chocolate. I, yeah. yeah, so it's, it's very right. good. It's a, it's a really neat little town. Yeah. Highly recommend it. Uh -huh. your journey on the great loop so anyway it was a great stay in Calvinford, uh, but we're anxious to move on tomorrow we'll be heading to hastings and oh don't uh, tell them oh, oh well babe. too late all right i already <laughs> told you we're going to hastings tomorrow and uh from there on it's going to be a pretty frenetic pace i yeah. guess we're going to move the boat every yep. day to try to fast, get fast, through fast. the locks and yep. uh on to get them uh, over with yeah get into the georgian <laughs> bay and yeah. uh we'll, we'll try to obviously try to enjoy things but uh we try to move the boat. Yeah. All right. All right. See you next See time. You.